Evening, that's right. We're talking about the I-235, I-44 interchange here in Oklahoma City. A pretty historic moment as the ribbon was cut on this project that cost $241 million. Drum roll, please. Without further ado, thank you, Jess. Here it is, the new I-235, I-44 interchange. The state calling it, quote, one of the greatest Oklahoma highway feats. Today, Governor Stitt and Secretary of Transportation Tim Gatz cut the ribbon on the interchange, the culmination of more than a decade of construction. Completing uh, this interchange is a huge milestone for our transportation system, uh, but we are just getting started uh, in the state of Oklahoma. Anybody that's driven through Broadway and I-44 in the last 30 years has had difficulty getting through it because it was an outdated design, it didn't move traffic very well, and it takes massive investments in this type of infrastructure to keep us out of gridlock. I'll be honest, growing up here, we called it Malfunction Junction. So hopefully it's a little bit better now. As we said, this decade-long project cost more than $240 million. The more recent part of the project, which started in 2019 to add flyover ramps at I-44 and widen 235, that cost $105 million. The governor adding that Oklahoma City and the metro is continuing to grow, and it's important to manage congestion to stay ahead of the curve, saying that Oklahoma City has a big advantage over other metros like Dallas and their communities. Mute times.